Namaste, Haryom. Reproductive organs, whether we talk about male reproductive organs or female reproductive organs, it's very, very important that we take care of our reproductive organs. And today I'm going to share a very simple practice, very, very simple. So simple that everybody can do it. And in fact, two practices I'm going to share with you. And if you practice these two practices, you will have healthy reproductive organs, whether male reproductive organs or female reproductive organs. So very first thing is that we must practice Bilavasan. Bilav means the this male cat. Okay. So how do we do Bilavasan? You just come in the basic position, which is this okay on your knees now inhale lift up your hips lift up your chest and your head and let your back come down okay then you exhale and push your hips forward bend your face forward an arc is formed of your spine so inhale Okay, exhale. Why is it called Bilavasan cat pose? Because before attacking anyone, this is how cat does. Hmm? He contracts all his organs. Inhale, exhale. He, he takes his strength by this practice. Same way, it strengthens your reproductive organs. And then back and relax in Vajrasana. Now you can practice it 10 times, so 10 repetitions, okay. Now one very important practice, generally people think that yoga is only about asana, only about movements, or only about respiratory practices, or only about meditation, but bandha, bandha, locks, different locks of body. Bandha is one of the most important part of human body. How do we do bandha? Sit in cross-legged position. Bring your hands in Jnana Mudra. Close your eyes. Sit in, sit in this position. Absolutely normal breathing. And contract your anus. This is Mool Bandha. Okay. So Mool Bandha. Sit in a normal cross-legged position. No forceful inhalation. No forceful exhalation. No holding of your breath. Just absolutely normal breathing. And just contract your anus from where you do stool discharge, right? That is anus, contract it. Sit quietly. Now I have contracted my anus and you will feel the contraction till your thighs, till your abdomen as well. Though you have contracted your anus, but you will feel the effect of this contraction throughout this area. Keep your eyes closed. When you feel you can't hold anymore, release. Then let's do it again. Try to practice it five times, uh, five minutes every day. Now you will see amazing results. It not only helps you in keeping your reproductive organs healthy, it is also a wonderful practice for spiritual elevation. For spiritual seekers, they must practice Mool Bandha. Now you practice it every day. Do not practice it more than five minutes in the initial time. Just five minutes is more than enough. Stay healthy, stay happy, make sure you do not uh, put laptop in your lap, you not put mobile phone in your pocket and um, uh, you are not in the, in the range of Wi-Fi all the time, especially during sleeping. Make sure there is no mobile phone, no Wi-Fi in your uh, room and uh, spend some time in Mother Nature, with Mother Nature and try to eat sattvic food. That's all for this episode. Stay healthy, stay happy. Lots of love, light and blessings for all of you. Hari Om.